Well, folks, we are once again hunting for some big games. I ended up buying a, a screwed up uh, version of Life Twisted and Turns because the life pod would not work. Um, there was a copy of Monopoly Brave that was sealed. That actually normally goes for about 50, 60 bucks, but unfortunately the seal was broken, the price was written in permanent ink on the box, and the corner of the box was a little bit damaged, so that took away the value. Anyway, hopefully this week we'll be able to find some cool stuff. Let's see what we can find. The game you can't get enough of. You know, we actually own this game, and it's pretty cool, but I think I had enough of the game after about 20 minutes. You know, I wish I would have had a game like this back when I was in elementary school. Instead, we had to read these long, boring books. Here's a cool little game, Electronic Taboo, the Platinum Edition. Now, this is like one of my all-time favorite games. The thing is, we have to have at least three players, and I don't really have a lot of friends, unfortunately. A unique game called Scrutinize. Uh, now, this game is actually kind of uncommon, and it's worth a little bit of money, but unfortunately, it's missing one of the main pieces, so gotta leave it. Here's an interesting game called Five Second Rule. Problem is, I think this game is one of those where you have a card that says name five colors, and then another one that says name five famous violinists from the 1800s. Yeah, a little bit unfair. Well, as you often hear law enforcement say, Nothing to see here! Well, someone was certainly cleaning out their closet. Here we have a 1942 Axis and Allies, an Othello from Mattel, and then we have the Game of Thrones Clash of Kings expansion, and then the board game right here. Yep, I'm definitely going to pick these four up. You know, sometimes when you buy games at a thrift store, there's parts in there that aren't in the original game, or in my case. I'm going to go ahead and look at the box. There are about four months worth of love letters to a guy named John from some chick, and it's from high school, 2004. A movie based on the World War II and some love letters. Hmm, does this sound familiar? So let me go ahead and give you the basic synopsis. Oh, I love you, I love you so much. Oh, baby, I love you so much. Oh, yes, I will always love you no matter what. I'm sorry, baby, that I cheated on you, but I like baby, but I love you so much. Even if we never go out again, I will always love you. I will always love you. Yeah, I'm sure your husband now really is going to appreciate that. I don't think so, Tim. Well, folks, we have a happy board game hunter this week. Four big game scores and some love letters. How can you beat that? If you've enjoyed this video, please feel free to subscribe. Have a great day.